My name is Jordan Neeland. I work for Riverview LLP in the construction division as a construction designer. Um, really big picture view of what I do as a construction designer. It's everything from working with surveyors to understand where we can build new dairies as well as understanding how our current dairies are built so that we can improve them with uh, remodel projects as we learn more about animal care and comfort. And when it comes to the new construction projects, once we have a site that is permitted and approved by county and state organizations for construction, then we d dive into what's called civil design, which is the overall site layout as well as how the dirt gets graded so that everything drains properly as well as uh, that all of the buildings, all the elevations from one building to the other play nice together. From there we move on to an architectural design which as you can see on the screen behind me is ultimately building floor plans, uh, what the building is going to generally look like once it's constructed. We pass those drawings along to building vendors who engineer and provide the final data that will be used in field for construction and then we also do the utility design for underground plumbing, electrical, natural gas, things of that nature that we can provide to not only our in-house crews but uh, our vendors as well so that they can get the utilities installed and everything coming together well with the buildings for our final milk date when the cows come to live in the new barn. And the goal of all of this and what our big picture drive is um, with the, the industry as a whole is to provide the best animal care and comfort, to provide a work environment that is safe for our employees, as well as providing an environment that will keep the cows well-fed, comfortable, and free of stress. Hello, um, I'm Carlos. I'm from Mexico. I work in a dairy farm, um, manager, assistant manager, so I, Part of my job is keep the cows happy and keep the employees happy. So if I keep the cows happy, uh, an example is provide feed on time, milk those cows on time. Then when I keep the people happy is when I provide the tools to do the job easy and safety. Hi, my name is Joanna. I'm from Benson, Minnesota. I studied animal science and agricultural business at the University of Minnesota, and now today I work in the dairies. My main job is working with the calving teams. So that includes everything from the cows that are about to give birth, helping any cows that need assistance in the birthing process, and then taking care of the newborn calves afterwards. So one of my biggest roles is helping our maternity teams understand information is really cool because all of our calves that are born, all of their information is recorded in our computer system for the rest of their life. So I can take that information, interpret it, and give that feedback back to the teams that I work with so that they know how their calves are doing and can continue to improve their standards and quality of care and give the animals the best outcomes possible. Hi, my name is Sierra Nori and I work on a beef and dairy farm in Morris, Minnesota. I am an accountant here and I work with our feed inventories for the cows, essentially grocery shopping for what they eat day to day. We manage the feed, so what is coming into our sites and what the cows are eating day to day. I chose a career in agriculture because I grew up on a small hobby farm and showed 4-H through high school. I went to school in Morris, Minnesota at the U of M and I studied organizational and financial management. Um, I love working at Riverview because I get to work with so many different people and, in, and get to be involved in so many different areas of the business. If you're thinking about a career in ag agriculture, I encourage you to soak up as much information from people around you as you can and ask as many questions as possible to deepen your knowledge.